What is up, junk lovers? Josh here with JM Junk Movers. And uh, I'm taking on a job that I usually say no to. It's that 60 by 16 modular home demolition. I got a few guys running the trucks doing exceptional work. Uh, so I feel like I can take on kind of the next big thing, which is big demo work. Uh, I really wish I could find some property uh, to get into the dumpster rental business. But so far, I haven't been able to, uh, to get what I need for that. So I'm going to kind of show you what we got going on here. Uh, and we will keep doing updates on it. Uh, it's kind of a process. I'm doing it the full legitimate way. So I'm getting permits. I don't think I need to get permits uh, because it's not, it's out of sight, right? But I'm going to do it legitimately. 100%, I've already started the whole thing to get permits. I've got all the utilities disconnected already. Uh, I've had the city verify it. I've had the utility companies verify it. Uh, I've got all septic tanks. Everything's verified. It's ready to be demolished. I gotta wait on one more piece of paper from the freaking government. Of course, they're... Don't get me started on permits. Don't get me started on permits. Anyways, so this is what we got. There's a little bit of stuff in there. Uh, all the metals like the washer, dryer, uh, dishwasher, refrigerator, and we have the guys pull out. We're gonna get a little metal pile going here. You know, we're gonna be demoing this shed as well. All of this random little stuff we're gonna be hauling off. All of these tires we're gonna be hauling off. When I walked the property, I counted 42 tires and one tractor tire. We're not taking the tractor tire though because it cost me $500 to uh, get rid of it. So I don't take tractor tires anymore. Uh, I still have one at my shop. <laughs> we did not charge enough for that, guys. Uh, but again, it's if you do things legit, you, you do things legit all the way. And I don't just dump tires. So anyways, uh, we're going to be demoing all of this. So I'm going to have the guys pull things out, you know, make the metal pile, pull things out. Uh, we're going to have to cut these just like we're going to have to you know plasma torch cut the base of that lots of metal out here um so it's going to be you know multiple loads we're going to have the guys put all the tires in one giant pile uh and then once they're done with all the tires you know third fourth load out here uh, they're going to take all those and dispose of them properly we're going to be demoing this boat uh and recycling of the trailer uh, it's it's not in good shape. It's in really bad shape. I mean, it's it is falling apart. I ain't got the time to restore. So and then we got another big old shed back here. It's beautiful out here though. Nice windy. I mean, it would suck if you're demoing right now because all the crap's gonna fly everywhere. But that's okay. Uh, then we got this shed out here all this little stuff just tires 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 and this shed has to be cleaned out before we start demoing it and then all of this random stuff like seriously it was used to just dump stuff like all these tires right here tire 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 and then i don't know what that is this sweet little trailer with more tires and it's got the metal frame with wood support. So again, some we got to chop up and dispose of all of this. So all this little stuff we're going to be using a tractor for. We're not doing this by hand. We're going to have a tractor. Uh, when we do the demo work of all this stuff, this is all tractor work. So super good job. Oh, look, two more tires. Freaking tires, man. You know, whenever you get out in these areas, the land is the trash can, like a lot of people. And then there's more trash right there. But that's about it. The soil out here is super nasty. Uh, so we have to have three days of dry to be able to come out here so we don't get stuck. Because we love getting stuck. <laughs> uh, and this soil out here is nasty, man. Nasty, nasty. So that is the job. Uh, I'll actually be making a video of the the demolition of the main uh, modular home. That's gonna be sweet. 
it's not too often you get a video of that so i'll be breaking down the videos having fun uh the the undercarriage the frame that's gonna be the most difficult part because i've never cut like one inch thick or it might not even be one inch it might be like half inch or three quarter inch steel but that's some thick steel and it's 60 foot our trailers are 14 feet which means i have to cut it like four times which really stinks because it's it's a beam like this right one cut two cut three cut four cut five cut six cut seven cut eight cut so actual eight cuts not including the axles and the tongue and all that stuff so anyways i don't think i've shown you guys my truck that's my baby it's a little 1500 gmc sierra nothing special but looks sexy look at that mm -hmm. i do attach the utility trailer to it uh, the benefit of my utility trailer is it's got a drop down gate so i can handle any job on my own I don't have to lift into the back of a bed. Uh, so I take care of like furniture. If the guys are overwhelmed with work, I take care of the big bulky uh, jobs. And we have three RV storage facilities right now. So one storage facility is for resale, repurpose, donate. The other one is recycle. And the other one is our training facility. Uh, so we just, I just drop stuff off there so I don't have to waste all the time going to the landfill. Uh, my time is better spent doing this stuff so been uh incredibly busy guys uh year over year growth for the first quarter is 77 percent which is massive huge growth uh and that's net profit growth net profit growth so uh all all expenses taken out it's it's been phenomenal and the numbers have have done increased quite a bit so uh doing good things doing good things Hitting everything in stride and just trying to make life uh, make sense. <laughs> so we're uh, we're really busy, man. Uh, or ladies and gentlemen, not man. Sorry, we're really busy. Uh, we're very blessed. Oh, yeah, sorry. All right, I'll get that later. Anyways. Uh, super good. We're going to be having our Suzu uh, dump truck land within about two three weeks. Uh, and then immediately we're having photography uh, sessions for website pictures, um, for marketing, all that fun stuff. So big things in Jam Junk Movers. And we, uh, we're we hiring our third W-2 employee in two weeks. And then in uh, three weeks after that, it's going to be our fourth W-2 employee. So it's going to be awesome. Looking forward to it. I'll give you guys updates. So I haven't made a video in like months, just kind of mo lost the motivation of why am I doing this? Uh, really just taking away my time. So, uh, but this was a cool video. I think you guys would enjoy that. Hopefully you enjoy it. Hopefully you're staying busy, making money. Uh, junk removal is awesome. And just remember, keep growing. If you don't keep growing, then you hit stagnation and you die. So keep growing. See you guys. Have a good one.